Hey everybody, this is Dave from OrgonGenerator.com and in this video I'm going to provide a basic overview and tutorial about our Organite Pyramids. We get a lot of questions asked about Orgone Pyramids, so I'm going to go through a lot of those questions and provide answers. Uh, some of the questions are phrased a little bit differently, so I'm just going to go one by one, but they're all getting at, you know, they're getting at the same topic. Um, so I'm just going to go through each bucket of questions and provide an answer. I'm going to shoot a, a second video that's going to be a more advanced tutorial on how to most effectively use our Organite Pyramids um, by themselves with a generator. And I'm going to go in depth on features and functionality so that you can get the most out of your pyramids. Uh, but in this video, I'm going to cover some of the basic high level questions just to, uh, to give a background and uh, an overview. So let's get started. The first question, uh, which is very basic, uh, what is an Orgone Pyramid? What is an Organite Pyramid? So online you see a lot of colorful ornate pyramids being sold. Um, some of them have gemstones, some have a little bit of metal, and, uh, and, and combined with resin. Those are Orgone Pyramids, or supposedly Orgone Pyramids. And the purpose of an Orgone Pyramid overall is to attract uh, life energy. Uh, it basically acts as uh, an orgone accumulator pyramid, you could call it that, an orgone energy pyramid. Uh, so that's uh, supposedly the purpose of all orgone pyramids. We believe our, our pyramids are, are real orgone pyramids. We believe they're the best orgone pyramids um, because we believe they're the most effective at uh, attracting and accumulating universal life energy, chi, prana, orgone. All those things are the, the same thing. Now, our pyramids are made of organite. And we have the only authentic organite pyramids for sale anywhere on the internet. Uh, organite only comes from one place. We work with the inventor of organite and the inventor of the organ generator, uh, Carl Welts. So we have the only authentic organite pyramids available anywhere. You can only get them from our site. So the difference between an organ pyramid and an organite pyramid is, you know, an organite, our organite pyramids are organ pyramids because we believe they're so effective at, at attracting organ. But another organ pyramid uh, is not an organite pyramid. Does that make sense? So what are orgone pyramids made of and what is an organite pyramid made of? So orgone pyramids, as I mentioned, they can have, you know, around the internet, there's a lot of different types. Um, some have metals, some have gemstones, um, <clears throat> crystals, uh, and, and they're made of resin. And I'm going to have another video where I do a comparison between ours and, and some of the other ones that you can, you can see. Um, our pyramids, our organite pyramids, so organite is a combination of organic and inorganic material. So for the organic material, we use high quality carbon-based epoxy. Uh, for the inorganic material, we use very, very fine iron powder. Um, our pyramids are dark gray. They have a shiny metallic sheen, which you can see. Um, they're extremely dense, very dense, and they have no visible layers, which is important. I'm gonna talk about that later. Um, we use the same recipe developed by Carl uh, over the past 20 years. So this is, this is 100% authentic organite. And we've worked uh, this year with a material science PhD to perfect the look, the feel, and the composition of the pyramids. And so we've got the different sizes you can see. Let's see if we can get the small. So here's a small, medium, large, and giant. And we sell them individually and we sell them in sets. We use the highest quality materials. Um, Carl has searched the world over the last 20 plus years to, to find the best materials for this. And we believe that, uh, the, that, that we found them and that's what we use in our pyramids. So how do orgone pyramids actually work? Uh, how does an organite pyramid work? Well, as you can see on our pyramids, shiny metallic and there's no visible layers. This is just smooth. You know, it gets a little hand mark that'll wipe off. Uh, that, that's all because we use so much iron powder. Also, we've got a, a felt bottom so it sits uh, really uh, softly on top of anything. But layers, the layering of organic and inorganic material, that is what is believed to attract and accumulate life energy from the surrounding area. Um, when you see pyramids, uh, so-called orgone pyramids that have visible layers of, you know, metal, color, you know, gemstone, those, because there's such few layers, we believe they're much, much less effective if, if they work at all. Uh, at attracting orgone energy from the surrounding area. In our case, um, so in essence, if you see visible layers, that is not an effective uh, at, at attracting orgone uh, because the interplay, the dynamic between the organic and the inorganic material, that is what we believe 
attracts orgone. So uh, in our case, because there are no visible layers, what that means is that the, the iron powder and the epoxy, the organic and inorganic material is so tightly bound that it's creating, in essence, thousands and thousands of, of invisible layers. And that's why we believe our pyramids are so effective at attracting orgone. You know, even our smaller pyramid, even our small pyramid, this is worth much more, we believe, in terms of attracting organ energy, this is worth much, much more than a, a much larger pyramid with visible layers because this is dense and tightly packed, very dense and tightly packed, no visible layers. So it would take a, you know, a pyramid with visible layers would have to be much, much, much larger to, to do, you know, to, to attract orgone at all. So... That, that's part of the value of our pyramids is that you can get something, you know, at a similar price and uh, at a similar size, but it's going to be much, much more powerful because of the interplay of the organic and inorganic material with all of these layers. And the goal of our pyramids is to not only look great, uh, but also be useful. So these, I mean, you can see them, they're sleek, they're dark gray. You could place this uh, as home decor. You know, you could place this in your house, not tell anyone what it is. And it's still going, you know, it'll look great and we believe it'll be useful as well. So what do orgone pyramids do? What does an organite pyramid do? What are orgone pyramids used for? So in essence, as I mentioned, they're used to attract life energy from the surrounding area. Uh, preferably positive life energy, though that's not always the case. And I'll talk about that more in another video, but I'll also talk about it in this video. So the goal is to attract positive life energy and then uh, spread it to the surrounding area. So... Uh, this is an essence, you know, and I say when connected to a generator, you want this to be filled with positive life energy and then it will uh, spread it kind of like a lamp spreads light. It'll, it'll spread it around the room uh, and then you get reap the benefits of, you know, additional positive life energy. However, our pyramids, you know, in any pyramid that attracts orgone, there's positive life energy and there's negative life energy. There's positive orgone and there's negative orgone. It's possible for a piece of organite to attract negative energy as well. You want to avoid that, and if it does happen, then you want to clean the organite. And I'll talk about that later. But the overall purpose is to attract and accumulate positive life energy and pass on the benefits of that positive life energy to the surrounding area, to, to your family, to your pets, to your home. Now, do orgone pyramids work? Do organite pyramids work? Uh, as I mentioned, some so-called orgone pyramids we don't believe don't work at all or they work very, very minimally. Do our organite pyramids work? We believe yes. We believe this is the most effective substance that's been found to accumulate life energy. And we believe these will pass on the life energy, whichever type, you know, preferably positive, will pass it on to the surrounding area and to people. So the benefits of an organite pyramid is that you will have an excess of life energy that's been accumulated and it'll be focused in one spot. Um, when people have more life energy, they, you know, we, we get people telling us that they sleep better, that their the energy in their house is better, that um, that they're more relaxed, that they're calmer, that the that that the 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 room is livened up, and those are just some of the benefits. Um, I would suggest on our website go and look the reviews both for the pyramids and the generators, and you'll see a lot of uh, a lot of uh, really positive feedback from people who who uh, who love the products that they have. Now we get a lot of questions on how to use an orgone pyramid, uh, where to put an organite pyramid, uh, you know, where do you where do you place an organite pyramid? And that's a really good question, and that's what I'm going to really dive deep into in the second video. But what I'll say is this: um, you can place this in any room in the house. Like I said, they look really good. Uh, if, if they're just by themselves, you know, we recommend placing them in a place that's uh, you know you could place it next to a plant. A plant, like all living things, a plant is an orgone generator itself. You know, a human is an orgone generator. A, your dog is an orgone generator. Any living thing generates life energy. So when you put the the uh, the organite pyramid next to some, like a living thing, like a plant, or you put it in a a natural place like a garden or near a stream, you know, positive orgone is is about movement. It's about flow. So when you put one of these pyramids uh, next to that, it will accumulate life energy from that flow from from that living thing. And, and, and fill up like a battery, like a battery or like a, a, a tank, like a gas tank for a, a positive, positive orgone. So you can place these, you know, we recommend placing these in a more positive environment in your house, you know, in your house or in your garden, um, on your property. There's a lot of places that you can put them. Now, we think the best way 
to use our pyramids. So we sell them individually, but we also sell them in sets. So this is, for instance, you know, our sets come with a small anchor pyramid that, uh, that you, let me move this. I'm trying to make it look nice. So our, our pyramids come with small anchor pyramids with a set. So this is a three large set with one uh, small. This is a four, or excuse me, a three giant set with one small. This is a four uh, large set, which would have one small. Um, uh, that would be, you know, I've got a medium and two more. That's a three medium set with one small. So we, do, uh, we made our pyramid sets to be preferably linked with an orgone generator. We believe, um, you know, people ask, how do, how do you charge an orgone pyramid? Um, we believe the best way to do that is to uh, have a set and keep it near your generator. Uh, and our sets come structurally linked, and I'll talk about that in a second video. But in essence, the best way that we believe to charge an orgone pyramid is to, uh, is to link it with your generator so that the, you know, the generator, which we believe actually generates uh, orgone energy versus just accumulating it. Meanwhile, the organite pyramid uh, accumulates uh, positive orgone. So the generator is producing positive orgone. The pyramids are accumulating the, the, the orgone from the generator. And we believe that's, um, these generators are more powerful and efficient than, say, a plant. Now, maybe if you're in a forest, okay, that could be you know, deep in a jungle with tons of life just swirling around. Okay, that's probably a pretty high orgone place. But for most people, you know, in our modern society, this generator is the, is the easiest way to produce orgone quickly. Um, and quickly and directly. So the best way to charge an orgone pyramid, in our opinion, you know, you could put it next to a plant and, um, or, you know, in a stream, but link to your generator, near your generator, or structurally link to your generator. So all the pyramids can, uh, can accumulate the, the organ produced by the generator. And we also get the question, you know, if an organite pyramid accumulates uh, negative organ, how do you cleanse? How do, how, do, how, do, how do you cleanse an organite pyramid? Well, if the generator is producing a continuous stream of positive orgone, that is getting the negative orgone out. That is replacing it. So when, when people ask how to use an orgone pyramid or where to, uh, you know, where to put an organite pyramid, where to place an organite pyramid, we believe the best way to use it is with a generator. And then you can keep your pyramids near the generator like it is right now. Or because they're structurally linked, you got the set, if you get a pyramid set, it'll be structurally linked to your generator and then you can place organite pyramids all over your house and they're gonna continuously receive a stream of orgone uh, no matter where they are as long as they're linked to your generator. Then uh, I like to call that like an, or, uh, an organite lamp. You know, this almost becomes a lamp because it's got a continuous stream of orgone and then it's just pulsing out that, uh, that positive orgone to the surrounding area uh, continuously 24 seven. You can keep the generators on 24 seven, that's what we do. I mean, I have not turned this thing, I have not turned most of my generators off in almost a year. And most people, I mean, we, you can really keep these on 24 seven and they last for years. Um, so we believe that's the best way to use an organite pyramid is structurally linked with your generator next to your generator, you know, in conjunction with an orgone generator. And you'll get the benefits of the generator and you'll get the benefits of the organite as well. Um, so that's a basic overview. Those are, those are the questions, um, you know, just what is an organite? Uh, what is an organite pyramid? How to use it? That, those are the basic questions that we often get. I hope this was useful. Uh, keep an eye out for uh, the second video where I go in depth on how to use our pyramid sets and our pyramids with our generators. Uh, it's going to be a more advanced tutorial, but uh, I think it'll be very useful.